Greetings! My name is Ruth Eagle. I am the creator of Hazel Twig, and today we are going to make an outrageous beret. This is Georgie the Girl Scout, and she has just been adopted, and she will soon be making her way to California. So before she goes, I would like to show you how to make a beret. This is her uniform. When she has a cold meeting, she will wear her coat and her scarf. And she will also wear this adorable beret, which is very easy to make. As slow as I am, it took me less than an hour. So, it goes like that. Here's how you make it. You take your tape measure and you measure around your doll's head. And don't hold the tape measure tight. Just uh, like if I were to hold it tight, her measurements would be about 12 inches around. So I go loosely, say about 13 inches, because you got fabric in there too. So then I pull little round things, jars, a tuna can, and I try and find something that's about 13 inches. And I also get bigger tins and I hold them up to this girl's head and try to get something that I think would be about the right size. So I picked, you know, a couple of tins. You put it on a piece of paper, trace around the big tin and then center the little tin and uh, trace around that and then you cut it out and you have a donut shape. And for larger headed dolls, my wonderful bank gives out these great big calendars and I just use these for the larger headed dolls. Um, so what you need to do is uh, then this will just fit her, you know. So when you trace it out, don't forget to add your seam allowances. I use about a third of an inch on a small doll. And then you will take and cut out two of your lining fabric and two rounds of your outer fabric. I got some contrasting fabrics to show you the difference. Then you take one of your lighting and one of your outers and you cut out the center circle without forgetting the seam allowance. You sew around the center, clip it, and then La, 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 right sides together and then you're going to go like this du voila simple then you're going to take and put the right sides together of your outer fabric and put the right sides out of your lining you're going to sew around here you're going to clip it you're going to turn it and you will have a beret. The last important step. I spritz this and I go like this with my iron and ch -ch 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 -ch. so you don't look like you have two pancakes resting on top of each other. So you can kind of blend this, this outer seam. And that is how you make a beret for your little dolly. So, thank you very much. You are my favorite. Ha!